Now, we have discussed addressing modes into the details. You can watch the video accordingly. Now, we are going to solve one gate question uh, on this particular addressing mode. This question came in the gate 2005. This is a long question, very big, very long and you are supposed to take a long time to read it and get the meaning and then you can answer it. Consider a three word machine instruction. Three word means one, two, three. Three word machine instruction. The first operand destination that is A R 0 uses index addressing mode. So, the first operand is using the indexed addressing modes. When you are reading, also you should do the sketch. That means, it index addressing mode means the address of the operand is to be calculated in this way. Okay. So, an R0 as the index register. So, that is the index register. In short, I am writing it as IR index register. The second operand that is the source at the rate of B uses indirect addressing mode. So, at the rate of B uses indirect addressing mode. I am writing in short indirect addressing mode. That means we got the idea that B is containing the address of the operand. B is containing the address of the operand. So, that is called, called as indirect addressing mode and R0 is the index register. Okay. A and B are memory addresses residing at the second and third words respectively. That means A and B are memory addresses means they are nothing but variables. Okay, this much we have discovered. The first word of the instruction specifies the opcode. So, this add is opcode that is quite obvious it is opcode. Opcode means operation code means instruction. Okay. The index register de designation and the source and destination addressing modes. Okay. During execution of the add instruction, the two operands are added and stored in the destination that is the first operand. That means, they are getting added operand number 1 and operand number 2 is getting added and the result will be stored in operand number 1. So, it is as well as, well as the source and also the destination register and it is all only the source register. Calculate the number of memory cycles required to execute the instruction. So, that is the question how many memory reads or machine cycles are required. So, let me go for the solve. So, now see for this one I want I shall have to get the address stored in the variable A. So, here I require one memory read please try to get me. A is holding the address of the address. So, that address plus register 0's content will be added to get the address. So, at first I shall have to calculate this particular address and from this particular address I shall read the data. So, for operand read, so operand, operand 1 read. So, I required 1 memory read or machine cycle, it was a memory cycle memory cycles yes. So, what is memory cycle? Okay. Now, in the second case B is containing the address of the operand. So, B is containing the address of the operand. Let us suppose B is pointing to this location and it is containing 2000 as it is indirect addressing mode. So, I shall have to go to the location number 2000. Then I shall get the say data is 40. So, for this one I require two memory read or memory cycles. So, to calculate or to get the first operand I require one memory read to get the second operand first time and second time I I shall have to read two me, uh, memory cycles. So, now I shall go for addition and the result will be stored will be for another machine cycle. So, this is for the operand 2. And to store so in total 1 plus 2 plus 1 so 4 memory cycles and that will be the answer so this is the answer so whenever this sort of questions will be coming please concentrate whether it is in the index addressing mode or base register addressing mode or direct indirect register direct whatever you should concentrate on that particular one you should take that point and then you should calculate the number of memory cycles or memory read 
whatever the term is there in the question. So here the answer will be 4. Please watch my uh, previous video where we have discussed addressing modes in details. Thanks for watching this one.